So for me, I have identified as a woman my whole life and that's been very enclosing for me personally. It's felt like I've been in this box of rules and expectations that I picked up and then set for myself. So I stepped out of the woman box. I now identify my gender as non-binary. And what does that mean, non-binary? Uh, if a binary is like ones and zeros within a computer, then the gender binary is like male, female. So me being non-binary, it's like I am not male, nor am I female in my entirety. I'm a mix of both, and I fluidly move between these two textures. You know, if femininity is like touching a rose petal, and masculinity is like touching tree bark, you know, what does that feel like to hold masculinity and femininity within our torso, within our experience of embodiment? And I have allowed myself, you know, using language to frame it, I have allowed myself to move between those at will, naturally, and it's more freedom than I knew it was an option for a human to experience. The best thing that's ever happened to me <laughs> is uh, allowing myself to remember that I am transgender. <laughs>